So, tell us your name, your grade, and how you got into golf. My name is Lennon Nijmeyer. Uh Next year I will be a senior. This year I am a junior. And I got into golf probably about the summer after my eighth grade year. My dad started golfing and eventually he got me into it. And in reality, I haven't been golfing that long. One thing that uh, I believe golf has over a lot of other sports is the mental aspect of it. No. Through 18 holes of golf, your club face is on the ball for less than a second. You have to be completely focused for five hours straight, and it is mentally exhausting. <laughs> the bomb dog. We don't have a range in Concordia, so we have to drive 35 minutes to go to a range. As a team, we actually qualified for state and are going next Monday and Tuesday. And also as a team, we've won multiple tournaments. Our top four especially is unbelievable. Uh, consistently shooting in the 70s and 80s. And I think we have a good chance of making it to the second day this year. Dude, no, um, Trent has a 69 degree club. How do you have a 70 degree? No, it's a 69 degree. <laughs> Why is it a 69 degree? Know, but he has one. Go. Pull out. Pull out. I put him in your bag. Pull out, pull out, pull out. I've never How actually... How many people have you dated from here? No, I've never actually dated anyone from Boy, but I've talked to two. Oh, you've dated that one girl. You need more rich. fingers, Lennon. Come on, Lennon. Just tell us. I spit it out. We got no, you. I have talked to you. a girl named it's, Hannah. It's from the there. rich one. She's not rich. She's short. She's not rich. We know you're okay, gonna be the Okay, her grandpa's minor. rich. <laughs> no, She's her stepdad short. is rich. So you do know exactly who we're talking about. State this year is being held at Turkey Creek in McPherson. Uh, the course felt really nice, really scorable. And I actually got the opportunity to play there as a freshman for regionals. So I have some experience behind playing, and I've played it more than these guys. So. <laughs> I don't know why I started laughing, bro. I can't do this. <laughs> Personally, is a pretty good round, practice round. My irons felt really good. Going into the practice round, I was pretty confident. It's a real scorable course. Some shorter par fours. The par fives are pretty straightforward. I felt like the guys I played with, they played really good. I like, had a 76 and a, like an 82. I feel like we have a good shot at making day two on Monday, uh, but we'll see. So, honestly, there's not as much pressure as I thought there'd be. Um, I'm just trying to go out there and play my best golf. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Get it. Woo! Come on. Come on, another one. That's a state championship. That's a state chip there, baby. Come on. You know who it is. Come on. I mean, there's a lot going on with senior year, with graduation and all that, and that's kind of kept my mind off of golf, but... Being able to focus in on golf, and there's not really a whole lot of pressure on me.
loop. But hey, it's a fairway punch. And scoreboard. <laughs> I'm right over these trees. Yeah, right over these trees. It might be too far left, I don't know. But I hit that good. Barely hit the green. The massive green and barely hit it. Nice ball, Foster. Guess a five iron's not the club. I'm actually a three time state champion javelin thrower, too. Uh, I gotta make sure I make this first, Steve. This is no gimme. Unless you call it good, good. Okay. That's easier out to play he put up a good score made it to the next day but for everybody else they didn't really play up to their capability I was pretty upset with myself I feel like we could have played a lot better as a team uh, we definitely did not play our best golf all around it was pretty disappointing we all believed we could make it to the second day. Uh, we came up a little short, but... Um, probably my favorite part of the season was just getting to go out every day and practice with the guys. I had a good time with them. Had a good time with the coaches, Steve and Gene. Um, they really taught us a lot of good life lessons that we can carry on for a long time. And yeah, just had a pretty good season. Stuck in them 20-something